So did it swerve then, that free kick, or did it go straight? Um, well, obviously, I'm going to say it swerved. Um, you know, I've been a few of the lads, we always you know, stay out after and try and you know, practice free kicks. And you know, this one's paid off. You know, I've been taking a few. Some have been on target, and you know, that one luckily went in. Well, the one at Accrington stung the keeper's fingers, didn't yeah. it? And people have been waiting for you to crash one in since then? Yeah, I've been waiting myself. You know, I've uh, been speaking about you know, me wanting to score. Know, a few more goals and you know I've got two and three games so hopefully I get a few more now. How hard was Monday after Saturday with, with a quick turn round and the fact that Southend really pushed you after you got 2-0 up? Um, yeah definitely obviously you know it was a great start going 2-0 up but obviously when you got a 2-0 lead so early on you seem to I think it's naturally to tend to you know, may not sit, think the game's in the bag but you know you've got a comfortable lead you may you know, take your foot off the gas a bit but you know, I think you know, uh, credit to them. They did obviously seem to throw the kitchen sink at us, and you know, we handled with them well, and you know got the three points, which is you know fully deserved considering the games that we have took the lead and you know not held on. That one, I think you know we deserved considering all the games before that. One of the lads just gone out to training, saying, "What are you doing today? Passing and possession." I mean, that's 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 sixty percent of winning the game isn't it actually keeping the ball and making sure that the opposition have to work hard to get it back yeah obviously when you, you know, the more you've got the ball the less you defend and you know, the less you defend the less like you're going to concede goals so you know, especially in you know, our team I think that's you know, majorly important you know, the way we pass the ball the way we keep it is a big part of our game Northampton at home they played I think end of an hour with 10 men mm -hmm. you had to work hard to break them down Junior got the goal in the end but yeah. does that give you a, a steer as to how difficult Saturday is going to be yeah wow. Well, I didn't. I sat the whole game on the bench, but um, you know the lads had to work hard for it. You know, especially with you know ten men, and they proved you know that they're a good, tough. You know, made it hard for us to play. So um, definitely be harder, especially away from home. But you know, away form has seemed to uh, picked up. So hopefully we can carry on. Well, four wins already away from home. That, that, that says that you can you can go to places and, and chisel out results. Well, yeah. You know, when I first came here, it seemed to you know that the home form was great, but the away form was not as good but we seem to have turned that around now so look if we pick points up at home and then obviously picking good points up away you know it leaves us in good stead. There has been some um, talk in the media about your position at Portsmouth yeah. that's come out from the Portsmouth end what's what's your contract position at Pompey and what's your understanding of the situation as it is at the moment? Well I only signed a one-year contract at the end of last year um, you know, I got offered two, but you know, I only ended up signing a one. And I've only read the paper myself. I've only spoke to a few, you know, members at the club, and they've not really filled me in. I've only like, you know, it's only come from the paper, and I've only read. So, um, you know, I just have to wait and see what happens. I just want to be playing here and play as many games as I can, and just wait to see at the end of the season. It's got to come from the horse's mouth, from Steve, hasn't it? Really? Well, yeah, definitely. You know, it'd be. Uh, just give me a phone call and then tell me what's happening, really. But you know, I'm just going to concentrate on playing here. Is this as enjoyable a spell as you've had playing anywhere? Yeah, I, yeah, I said the other day, it's probably the happiest I've been. Um, you know, getting a good run on the side, you know, playing, playing OK like consistently as a team and individual. So, um, yeah, definitely I'm enjoying it. Do you want think? Thank you. Manuel, well, things have sort of kicked off for you since that Northampton home game, haven't they? Since yeah. your Bradford away, I think, was just after that, and that's when you really came in a major mark and you've not really looked back since yeah, then? Yeah, I've, I've said it numerous times how much you know it's, it was frustrating being on the bench like it is for any other player, and you know, especially for me coming here, wanting to play, coming on loan, and obviously spending time on the bench was you know not ideal, but you know I wanted to play. I know I knew as soon as I'd like get a good run on the side, I'd hopefully show you know my capabilities as a player and what I could bring to the Cheltenham side. Yeah, I know it's early days and you haven't spoken to Steve Cotter yet, but if if you are if you do find yourself a free agent at the end of the season, do you think a move here can be possible? Yeah, you know, I keep my um my options open for anything. Like I said, you know, I'm only I'm only nineteen, I've played uh you know, a number of games now, so hopefully I'd have you know, good options come the end of the summer if it don't work out at Portsmouth. Yeah. yeah. And in knowing a club and enjoy knowing that you're enjoying yourself at the club, do you think that can go a long way towards attracting you? Should yeah, obviously it, it does help when you um when you've been at a club, you know you know everyone at the club and especially the way it's going it's been like a good spell so yeah, obviously that does you know keep in your head and uh, in your mind yeah but you've had a brief taste of the first team football at championship club you know I'm sure there's going to be other clubs 
around thinking maybe you could play at a high level? Do you think that's yeah? Obviously, I want to be as you know ambitious as I possibly can, and I want to play as hard as I can. So obviously, it, it depends, like I said, what happens to me and you know who's interested or how the season goes. But like I said my my main aim is just to be playing games and you know do well for Cheltenham and hopefully. Cheltenham do well as well, so then you know we'll see at the end of the season. Yeah, having the amount of games you've got on your CV, that's that's not bad for a 19-year-old, is it? Yeah, yeah. I turned 20 in March, and you know hopefully by the end of the season I could kick on with a few more. And like I said, it'll all be good for my CV, you know, no matter what happens. Yeah. Do you think your your goals? That you can, I know one of them is a free kick, but you you get into more attacking positions. Is that is that coincidence that not since Michael Poop came back into the side? Um. Yeah. Well, it, yeah, I don't think it's no finny to birdie being out the side or. You know, I just seem to have fallen in the right place for me, and you know, I've been trying with, you know, my set pieces and you know whatnot. But I've just been in like the right place at the right time, especially in the breath of game, and then you know the free kick that went against South End. But hopefully, like I said, I can you know, get a few more goals this season. Yeah. Do you enjoy getting up and down, or do you prefer when you're sort of sitting and spraying it around um, from deeper positions? I think there's a there's a very variation of the both really. I like when I've got possession, I like obviously getting on the ball. You know, whether it's deep or in advanced position, but you know, I like starting off play. But obviously, to score goals, you've got to be further up the pitch. So it's probably a you know variation of the two. Yeah.